Hi YouTube. Um, if some of you have been watching me on uh, Instagram, you'll know that, to be honest, the last three days have been nothing but short of uh, of a nightmare for me. Um, I was nearly in tears yesterday. I just felt like crying. Um, this machine was down here on my little uh, shop floor, and because it's such a low ceiling, um, we we tried everything to get it up on the bench. Um, if it wasn't for a good friend and customer, um, Mr. PLD, um, and another fellow YouTuber, this machine wouldn't be where it is today. That's fact. Um, there's no other way than what he's done for me, in short, got that machine onto that table. Other than that, I would have had to have ripped out everything I'd already put in um, and maybe bought a box uh, to put it on. But if I'm, I'm going to be real honest with you, this machine has took every penny I had and then some that I had to borrow to be able to buy it. So the thought of then for another couple of hundred pounds to buy the box... I just didn't really have it to do it, you know, so then I thought, you know, what am I going to do? I can't be milling with my face on the floor, um, you know, so, but, but he come with his dad and my dad and we got winches in and a pump thing and, you know, we put it on logs and, you know, it was pumped up and, you know, it was dangerous, you know, it's very small in here, it's floating around and, but anyway, he's, he's up there and the reason why I've bought this and, uh, you know, spent every last bit I had, um, you know, is to try and better myself for you lot. You know, one day, you know, I'm going to try and make the best folders you, 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 you lot, the money can buy. You all know now what, what I'm like with the um, getting things right. And um, with this, is because it's digital. Um, I'll be able to do things extremely accurately, uh, you know, and exactly how I want them. Um, with the folding knives as well as other stuff with a milling sides, I can build now. I can build new attachments for my grinder, and you know I can build little things that I need, and you know. And I also have to give a big thank you to Mr. Wellings because it wasn't for him and his milling machine, um, which um, went to another good fr uh, uh, friend who I uh, by, I just sold uh, it, uh, that milling machine exactly what I paid it for, just to show the love um, from one friend to another. Um, you know, so he's now got a, a a great machine, and he does a lot of engines, which that milling machine is more suited to. Um, he'll be absolutely fantastic for what he needs for that type of stuff. Um, he's got a bit more about him than me. Without, I, you know, I couldn't. Um, you know, I wasn't sure how to add a, a digital readout on a milling machine and stuff. And unfortunately, I, you know, if you're not real good with that type of stuff, you sort of have to buy it up with it on. Um, but uh, uh, anyway. I thought I'd share this with you and you know the last three days I ain't been able to do none with the knives and it's been killing me and the last three days I you know I've never I haven't been this down in in a long long time um, with this machine you know when you've spent all the money you've got and it's sat on a floor and you can't do nothing with it and you can't get to your other machine to start working on orders that you've got to make um, to make some money I mean the bills don't stop coming in you know, when the work stops, you know, obviously, like anybody else out there who ain't got lots, you start panicking. And I really started to panic. You know, oh, sh excuse me, you know, what am I going to do now? Um, you know, I've got no way of getting to my grinder. I've got no milling machine because I hadn't got it. This was on the floor. Um, no way of getting it on the bench. You know, I've got my, my, all my leather orders to do as well. But, you know, when you, you, you know, all got to, you know, pre-orders for the knives and stuff, you know, and... You know, I'm real committed to getting people's stuff done and how they want them. And, you know, without being able to use these two, I couldn't proceed with that side. Um, you know, I've always played through the leather side. As you know, I have to do that in the morning and this on a night time. Um, I'm, you know, hopefully, if I real work hard with it for a year, I'll be able to, you know, things will even out. I might be able to finish, do both and finish at a reasonable time in a day. But uh, I don't mind. It's my love. It's my passion. It's what. It's my dream. Um, and when you got to, you know, when you really want to do something as much as I want to do with these fixed and folding knives, you know, I don't mind being here till one o'clock in the morning if that's what it takes. You know, if I want to, you know, if I make something for somebody, it has to be right. You know, and if I have to stop up all night to get it right, I will. Um, so that is why one of the reasons why I haven't been on um, and stuff. But I wanted to real share this with you and. I hope everybody's okay and I hope you're all doing okay and um, I feel a little better today, I'm a bit more happier today. I've 
you know I've cheered up a little bit the machines where I want it I had to cut the work table out <laughs> but I've got it back to how sort of how I want it now and you, a lot of you like it wouldn't it wouldn't matter to you having things in a certain place but obviously me with the OCD things don't go back where I need them to be it real stresses me out you know and it sounds pathetic but I lose sleep over stuff like that it real real gets to me you know when I want something to be in a certain place just like you know if I want them there and I can't put them there it really really grates on me and my brain just doesn't switch off and it really stresses me out I find it really hard sometimes but anyway you know I ain't one for all that type of stuff but I just wanted to let you know and um, explain to you all why I, I hadn't been on or anything like that so um, hopefully uh, you'll see a lot of the frame locks coming off this now and hopefully you'll see a lot better quality and um, there's nothing wrong with my other ones but obviously I'll be a lot more accurate with this um, I can do a lot more accurate milling and um, I'm going to build me um, I haven't got the room for a surface grinder and after, after the trouble I've had with getting this in I've realised that I think I'm going to have to build a surface grinding attachment for my grinder um, so and this machine will allow me to do that so that's my next uh, sort of thing in between everything else um, so Adam I do thank you Mr Wellings I thank you for helping me out with the mini machine and getting me started in the first place because without you and the machine that you were uh, sold me then you know I wouldn't have known where I was or I wouldn't have learned what I learned so it's a big thank you to you too also bud um, Okay, so take care. Uh, I'll do a video in the week. I'm going to upload that vid, uh, level one as soon as I can. Hopefully, I can have a little play with this today and get on with some more orders. I've got a lot to show you. I've been doing a meat cleaver, um, uh, the Dragon Slayer for uh, Mr. Unreal Smith, and one thing and another, and things are moving on. So I hope everybody's okay, and I hope you're having a lovely weekend. Take care. Bye for now. Bye.